Hello, Unboxing Buds. I'm Unboxing Bud Ryan, joined with Unboxing Bud Josiah, as always. Yo. And we have the June Cairn box. We actually just picked this up actually earlier today, and we completely forgot to start filming it. All right, let me get this open. Man, what the heck? Did they, like, glue this thing shut? Holy. Oh, it feels like. <laughs> You can see my box number on the side. Not that it helps them. Uh, I can do it. Shut up. <laughs> All right, so uh, step one, explore in here. Step two, explore up here. I'm going to skip that step and look up top. All right, Um. so let's see just what we got today. We got a cinnamon, honey cinnamon IPA crafted with a Upcycled Brewer's Malt, sustainable super grain bar with a combustible wrapper. Hmm. My reading skills are not that great. Uh, no. Here's, here's all this. So let's, uh, let's get into this. So I'm going to treat box. I already have treat if I can. Oh man, this is. This is gonna be a pain. Okay, let me just eh, tear it. So, some of that. so, looks like oats with some chocolate or something in it. Let me. Okay. I looked up flaxseed and stuff, and so has that kind of weird. See a box of Ranko seems to like it. Here, Ranko. Ow. Got my gum. Alright, um. Doesn't really have a whole lot of flavor to me. Not really, no. It says eat beer, but it doesn't really taste that great. Want some more beer food, Ranko? He's like, yes, please. Um. Yeah, you, as you can tell from the stuff, honey oats, it doesn't really have like a, it has more of like just a flax flavor, it has a little bit of salt flavor to it. But, oh, I can please forgot about this. He forgot his newspaper. So, well, let's see. Ooh, this is what I think it is. I think this is my new favorite thing. Yes. It's exactly what I think it is. I've been looking at buying a steel growler for a while. Oh, give me a teal one. No, I'm upset. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, I would prefer the red one. If you can't tell from all the red here, <laughs> my favorite color. So that's cool. So what is this? This is a there's a drink tanks temperature controlled 16 ounce insulated vessel. So that dishwasher safe. Uh, double walled. Come on. Touch. It's like glue. Just a little sticky tape. That's glue. Glue, glue. So, it's made in China. Damn. So, it actually has like the, uh, the cut marks in there for one ounce, two ounce, and five ounces. We you know if we got your booze and we need to mix things correctly. All comes with a case for some reason um no lid that's a lid because of two lids so <laughs> drink tank special lids all right let's see so drink tank also has the hot and the cold lid or the small mouth and the wide mouth since you're gonna want a smaller mouth for the hotter crap <laughs> Oh yeah, it's actually uh, insulated. It looks like is that a uh, thick plastic to it? Not insulated. I meant to say thick plastic, so it stays insulated. So, of course, suckers just snap on. Fortunately, there's no way to close this, which kind of sucks. But whatever. I was waiting for it to fly. <laughs> 
Yeah, it's not very nice to hang the left. Uh, what's this? Bottle break. Clean, safe bottle. Hydro pack. What the heck? Another way to clean your bottle. Clean your water. It looks like a cleaner. Not like a water cleaner, like a bottle cleaner. It says, fill container with warm water, add one bottle bright tablet, let stand 15 to 30 minutes for tough stains. Hot water, or hot tap water and longer, uh, longer standing times, one to eight hours may be necessary. Oh, four tough, okay, I, I was like, I'm confused, what? <laughs> Let it stand 15 to 30 minutes. And then it says four tough stains, hot water tap, and longer standing time. Uh, just, <laughs> I, was like, I don't understand. Discard solution and rinse. So. These are, they're little tabs. They feel just like this. It looks like they're just little small circles. So I'm assuming they're just soap. I'm not going to open this because then, you know, things get dirty. But looks like it's for all your... Looks like you probably throw it in here and let it get all dirty or let it dissolve and then shake it and wash it out. That's pretty obvious what my favorite thing is. Thing I'll be doing this. And then, oh, the best thing ever. You ready? Hair. I can always use hair. Ooh, it's so, it's so special. It's air. So this is from Air Plus Store, Storo Pack. So basically, you can scare small children and dogs, or suffocate small children if you still feel like it. All right, um, let's see yourself. <laughs> Give me something here. Yeah. Oh, hey, hey, wait a minute. Day one. I think this might be a lighter. Nope, it's the Day same one. color. <laughs> Man, they ran out of colors, They're just recycling them. I'm so disappointed. You can't. Oh no. Alright, so. Oh shoot. We're just doing the wall, it'll be covered. I know, that's the <laughs> point though. So. And then they have to stick them over there. Um, yeah, so overall, uh, if you're looking for like a survival box to just go out and get, this is probably not the best one at this point to just go out and explore with. Uh, Cause you're gonna look pretty foolish when someone goes. So, uh, what you doing? I'm going out in the woods. I'm gonna survive. Oh, you got a bunch of supplies? I got a cup. I ate some metal cup. I also got a newspaper. I'm gonna be fine. I guess you're like Bear Grylls. You could probably. Welcome to Slipstream, the Netflix of adventure films. Okay, I don't really care for that. So, for those of you who want three free months subscription for Slipstream. Yeah. Go ahead and enter in this code right here, and you can, uh, you know, you can watch whatever the hell is on here. I don't really watch a lot of outdoor shows just because it's kind of boring to watch people do stuff that you can go do. So, so this is everything that's in there. I kind of think it's dumb that they included the lids as a fourth item. <laughs> that seems kind of half-assed to me, you know. Mm -hmm. They just undid the lids from the top of this, and they're like, ah, oh, this is the product. No, honestly, this is probably, you probably have to order these separate. You probably just get the cup, and then you have to buy these, which is kind of a dumb little deal. Uh, but overall, these the cups, I think the cups are pretty much the only product here, isn't it? Yeah, well, you got a bag. And you got a cleaner. Um, the yeah. Nutri-Grain bar is crap. I'm never going to ever eat one of those again. If I eat air. Oh, I forgot. This is my favorite. So. <laughs> you know, I've always wondered mm. if you went, if you took this underwater with you, and then you bit into it, could you breathe in this air? Mm. Suck the air in. It's, it's a good question, huh? I'm not a professional swimmer, so or even someone who swims very often. I'm not saying I can't swim. I just, I just don't swim very often. I haven't, man, I haven't swam in like a couple of years. I haven't gone <laughs> into water in a couple of years. Mm -hmm. I spent too much time working. I work and then I come back here and I just want to be lazy. It's like, uh, so what's so it's cool. So you stick this suck up, yeah. Then you can pop it off. I can pop it off. So let's go. Oh, this is gonna hurt my finger. <laughs> ah, that's right. That's what the other is for. 
Leave me alone. <laughs> so, yeah, it looks like it's a really well-made mug. I mean, uh, I've seen similar ones at Walmart for like $30. You can eat that thing. That's yours. You can have it. Uh, I'm assuming that this is probably a better brand. I've actually never heard of uh, drink tanks. I'll have to look them up. Uh, maybe buy another one for unboxing Bud Josiah. I'm just kidding. I'm not buying him nothing. Oh. I'll get nothing. Let's you ate my cookies. No, I didn't. There's yes, some did. bar, not cookies. The, the last ones were in, were in the little blue bag from the snack pack. And you, you ate it. I ate the last one that you <laughs> left me. I know. I ate so many of them. I didn't plan on eating so many of them. It's just I started eating, and I was like, mm, I'm not going to stop. <laughs> so anyways, uh, I think both of our favorite things is this cup. Yeah. Literally because the only other thing was a granola bar and this. Oh, my favorite thing was a bag of air. Your favorite thing is a bag of air? Yep. I'd pop it right now, but I'd be too scared. I'm gonna, I'd, I'd be squeezing like this. I'm too scared that I'm going to hit my camera or it's going to be super loud on the camera. When people are watching at home, they're just going to hate me. So anyways, uh, let me actually check to see if there's codes in here for you guys. Um, came in my camera. That's nothing else. Uh, oh man, the obsidian box came with some cool stuff. I just want to read that. Oh, Mills cheese bites. Man, I love cheese. All right. It says, "Oh, here we go. Here's the codes for you guys." So there's that. And I think that's the only one of the codes. Look, what can you put in your drink tank vessel? Soup, juice, tea, hot or iced, hot chocolate, ramen, kombucha. I'm pretty sure I messed that up. Wine, cocktails, whiskey. Mmm. I'm gonna fill this up with whiskey and mix it with some tequila. And then unboxing about Josiah is gonna have to drink it all. Or he'll be voted out of the Big Brother house. That's not fair. Well, I'll record that and post it to the unboxing site. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so, all right. I think that's pretty much everything. Uh, oh, hey, look. It's clean. Oh, this is made in Oregon. It makes me a little more happier. I didn't even realize that. Uh, good thing is a bad thing. <laughs> well, <laughs> you live in Oregon, so... <laughs> you gotta support them, man. Mm, it's like people in California say they gotta support California. <laughs> you what? So that's like people saying that we live in California gotta support California. People in California do support California. <laughs> Which is what's wrong with them. Which is what's wrong with them? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so, anyways, the next box that should be here should be the. Uh, think Geek Box. Uh, from what I understand, I'm not 100 percent sure if they're just doing this like a trial run, but they are doing three boxes, and from what it sounds like, only three boxes. Over there, over there. And I am going to get all three of them. If it can, even if it's crap stuff, I'm Don't still going. Right oh my gosh, there's so much drool there. <laughs> he just destroys wood floor. Mm -hmm. You just look at. Anyway, so <laughs> back on track here. Uh, the Think Geek box is, I'm not 100% sure what's all in it, but it, they say it's only for three months. If it turns out to be longer than three months, then it's going to be one of those, we got to weigh in what do we get from it versus what we're putting into it, and that will decide if we keep it or not. Honestly, uh, it kind of looks cool. I, I've looked at a lot of Think Geek stuff, and it looks pretty cool. It's basically game memorabilia and stuff. I actually got a, uh, that's actually where I got my Lancer from. I got a Gears of War Lancer, which was a Think Think geek item that I got from the GameStop Rewards, which, yes, I am a nerd, but I'm a nerd who knows how to track and trap boar and squirrels and small children. Yeah, this is a whole other different style of nerd. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, no, so... Anyways, uh, that's that'll be the next box that's coming in. Should be coming in, unless they lied to me and they just took my money for nothing. 
funny. That would, I would be very upset about that. <laughs> they were not cheap boxes. Well, I mean, they're cheap considering some boxes. Anyways, we have gone on way too long. Anyways, the next box should be the Think Geek uh, capsule, I think is what it's called. Uh, you can send us boxes. Yeah, you can send us boxes. Uh, we live in... Where's... Where's... It doesn't have an address on it. Man, it sucks. <laughs> One of these has got to have an address. We live in 6605 San Landro Street, Oakland, California. 94621. Go ahead and send us all you want. <laughs> send us moldy cheese. Man, they would be so confused. People just start sending a bunch of moldy stuff. Like, horrible crap. Like, whoa, what is going on right now? <laughs> what have we done to anger people? All we do is create a more suitable and efficient way of cleaning your tools and cups and water bottles out in the wilderness. Anyways, so, if you like this box, then, uh, well, we have them every month. So, just keep on watching our videos. Or, you can light your phone on fire by throwing it in a fireplace. That'd be cool. If you do that, no go ahead. Too. Go ahead and uh, share that in our comment section uh, with your new phone. <laughs> if you recorded it, you should send us that video. Just, <laughs> just send us a comment below, and we'll give you our information so you can send us the video of you throwing your phone in the fireplace. <laughs> I don't really know what we do with it, but it'd be fun to watch. Anyways, uh, from all of us here on Unboxing Buds, I hope you guys enjoyed everything, and I hope you guys have a wonderful day.